to my channel space remote sensing and gis and today we will going to discuss a very interesting topic that is how to create a web app in arcgis online okay so that's what we will going to show you today i hope this will be very informative video for all so who is an interested to create a web app in arcgis online okay so let's start with that uh, chapter so let's move to arcgis online and where i already logged in okay with my credentials okay so let's start how we're going to uh, process it okay so now if you want to create a app the first thing you have to do you have to come to this content okay so in content you have a options to uh, create the app okay you see here here there is a two options will be there one is a new item another one is uh, create a app okay so in this case what you have to do you need to click on the create app okay and here you have a list of this uh, means apps whatever you are going to create okay so in this case uh, we are going to uh, generate a instant app so that is what we will going to generate okay so i will click on the instant app so let's wait for the results so instant app page uh, you can say it's a new web browser tab okay you can found it here so which is basically showing the instant app templates okay so that are available over here so on this particular uh, create a tab so you can also scroll down and various see the various types of um, templates whatever it will be there okay so you can select whatever the templates you want okay so in this case i will going to uh, specifically i will select someone and then i will show you how to create the app so if you want to understand about some specific uh, templates informations okay so here you have uh, options okay you can go with a view item details and it will going to show you uh, different informations about that particular app okay what it is actually represented so you can use this search options to uh, finding uh, the templates okay so so mm -hmm. this app capabilities is actually easy to find the templates okay so that can meet our requirement okay suppose in this case suppose i want something which is related to direction so i am typing the direction direction okay so you will see here if i click the direction so these are the two uh, you can say the app templates which is uh, coming to me okay so this is called app uh, capabilities which is search uh, return the two templates which is basically showing one is nearby and the zone lookup okay these are two options will be there so these two templates we can provide the directions for the mm. user okay so that is possible to do it here so as you seen here there is a various types of apps is already there okay so which will can use for your particular analysis okay so so in this case i am just going to open this particular basic template okay so once you select your template which is fine so then simply click on this choose option okay to open this particular uh, templates you have to give some proper name to understanding this particular uh, the apps which you creating now you can give a certain name of this uh, particular uh, uh, app name okay just like i am giving a name like <coughs> a like uh, demo underscore test study area study area So this is the name which I provide you. There is a few important parameter which you need to select. Okay, just like this is the location which I will going to do. That is based on our concerns. Okay, so our our concerns I have given. Okay, or you can uh, go for some other <coughs> options also, like Ozark. Okay, so these are the some name or the Ozark name will work. Okay, so that also you can give. Okay. <laughs> so these are locations which we will get and i already created one uh, folder okay in my um, in my uh, content okay so over there i am just trying to save okay so that i can identify it very easily so that is what is your test study area okay <coughs> i just give a name uh, suppose i can make like 
are concerned. Second day demo test study area. So that is app which I design it for this. Okay. Now once you've done all these things, now you can simply click on the create app and let's wait for the rest. So now in the left uh, of the panel, it will see here. Okay. So there is it is called basically express panel. Okay. So first thing which we are going to add that is the map. So I'm simply click on the map options. Okay. So now in this map panel, we have this options like select map source or on scenes. Okay, maps or scenes. So you can click over here. So whatever maps you want to <coughs> add uh, to this particular uh, image. Okay, so that you can select properly. So uh, let's see what the data sets we are going to select. So in this case, I'm going to use this particular Arkansas uh, study 2A map. Okay, so that's what we are going to use in this particular exercise. Okay, so I will just going to select that okay and then select map options i go and then this map whatever i just selected now so it will add it to my target map information which i just created okay so that is what how we're going to add a map to that particular uh, app which i'm going to create and you see here how nicely the maps which i previously created over this particular locations okay it came uh, very nicely now next is once you have this map now you can just simply click on here as a next and see here you just check that uh, legend is activated here or not so already we activated the legend so if you want the uh, fixed pop-up location so that also you can activate okay or you can go with the header if you want to activate so that also you can do it here so if you want to add some informations about the item descriptions like this map description and all those things so here see this is text alternative options will be there there so if you click over the maps and you can add whatever the information you want so i am not typing anything so whatever the existence will be there i just kept it that so just try to show you like how you can mention uh, some kind of map information like map is finding okay on the end engine hellenberg samenberg okay study area and proximity of the mines and quarries or the north of themselves which i written it over here and uh, it will be there so if you want to change anything and you want to give for your uh, means uh, according to your uh, objectives so that information also you can add it over here now the next steps is you can just move to the next okay and here you see here if you want to how to search like disable the scrolling layer list okay export so all these types of options you can able to activate over here okay search options you can give it here or not okay so let's see a few more things over here so here while you are searching so if you want uh, you can search by locations and that will come to this so here you have to add this uh, geocode service you can activate okay see so are finding locations by the geocode address okay so you can uh, edit it or something you can do but here you can add this information to the map then okay, few more like export you can do layer list you can uh, disable scroll okay so enable the map scrolling or you can say the layer listing okay so if you want to exporting so so these are the symbols you see here uh, that if i switch off this then you will only get the zoom in and zoom out option but if i just own this then you can import the certain level of uh, the map in into a pdf so that you can do it here layer you can list like whatever the layers will want see here uh, if i switch off uh, this layer list so that will not show but if i switch on this so this is what the layer list will show you so what are the layer you, you want to add okay so in your map so that you want to show so you can open the layer list visible scrolling is okay fine because i can i don't want this map should be scrolled down because this will focus only this particular study area so disable scrolling i will just stop okay so exporting also i don't want like uh, someone will export my map so that's why i stop the export also okay so now search open and start if you see here uh, if you find some locations okay over the some certain particular place so you can simply search by the address okay so that's you can activate over here so see here uh, these are the tools okay just uh, means what are the tools you want to add to your map so definitely you can add uh, something like this okay now next now you can go to the next and you see here here you can give the uh, light mode okay and dark mode or how we're going to uh, observe your app so that information you can give if you want to give or add some header okay so that you can do and how the header informations will come in the top of the bottom okay like top left and top right or you can see the home button where zoom control is what locations like top okay so zoom control locations if you want to drag it to the up okay so then you see here it is come to the up and if you want to put it in a down 
so it will come and sorry now it is a left now so if i want no it i just want this one is also left so see here it will come everything will come in a left okay so and if you want to now no i want to give this in a right okay so like that you can see the locations will change so that what you can able to uh, add and change you can do it over here suppose legend i want to give it in a uh, bottom right okay so i can simply drag it and see here legend and layers both will come in the right okay so this this options which we have so suppose if you want no the layers you want to take in the top so you can simply click it over here and the layers also it will come in the top so this is the way we can <coughs> adjust uh, this particular uh, section okay so if you want to change some bot color you can give and the theme will uh, not be applied when you are actually header off so i already off the header so that's why it will not going to show otherwise i have to go back and i have to activate the header, header again okay so these are the few important uh, uh, tasks which you have to uh, which you required for the apps which you are creating for the study which you did now in this far left button if you want to stop the expression so you see just express mode focus on the most important option considered for this circular app so turning off this express mode will provide you access to the all the settings support by this particular app okay so all the settings it will going to support by this particular app okay so that's what uh, it will going to create it over here so i will just come back on this okay so this is the way we can do it this is basically meaning that see if you are switch off the express now so these are you see here it is coming by uh, in a one row one by one inside so you can uh, easy easy to switch uh, one to and one other and you can control all these things okay but if you want to switch off and you just see here what will happen okay so if i just switch off okay so see this panel will uh, gone okay so you can't control directly from here so you have to go to next 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 like that's why you have to control and if you feel no or you have you don't go to go to next 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 you want to want a list to uh, switch from one to another one so then you can active this exports okay so if i do that and you see here it will come back okay now here uh, you can go in a map so it will show you the my map informations and details so uh, here see your map details okay so whatever you want to add if you want to add any more details you can view item details and map view okay all this informations you can show uh, over your data sets okay just this is my map okay so you see map area if you want to show some study area then you can activate that i don't want to do that because i don't uh, activate any particular uh, area which i want to show this is my target area which i already zoomed and um, create a map over there only so this is the way we can generate the many informations over here okay so once you feel that this uh, map uh, app is created uh, perfectly okay so i didn't add any more thing so you can go with the switch and scenes okay and finally if you want if you are happy with this apps okay you can simply click on publish okay and you can make it confirm so once you confirm it uh, your uh, app will actually published within a second so this is a very easy way i can generate whatever the maps i want okay so i can generate very easily i can publish in facebook or i can copy the link and send what to anyone to the uh, their whatsapps okay if i launch it okay so you will see within a second uh, the app which i created okay so that will come in front of me so i hope this video will be useful for everyone so if you like this video please uh, share to everyone okay and subscribe my channel okay thank you thank you very much next day we'll come with the another exciting video